Yo, what is going on, my husbandos and waifus? My name is Hermzar. Welcome to another live reaction review of Black Clover. If you guys are excited, make sure you guys go and drop a like for me because that would help me a lot. Subscribe and don't forget to click that notification bell, my boys. So I'm a little bit under the weather, which is really, really bad because as you guys know, next week I'm going to Anime NYC and my life is going to be extremely hectic within the next two weeks. But I'll give you guys an update, updated upload schedule when I get back. But anywho, my boys, in the last episode of Black Clover, the actual kingdom was being invaded by the elves and then Noelle's brother and sister were getting absolutely bodied not Nozelle but it was her sister I forget her sister's name and solid they were both getting bodied by the compass bitch so now we're gonna see if this is Noelle's awakening I hope so and we see Jack the Ripper actually do some crazy shit we're still yet to see like I said his full power even in the manga I'm sure there's still so much more to his power and why he is a captain yeah there's compass bitch right there I like how generally the head of the Silva family Nozel he's so emotionless whereas the, like the others are so like solid is a bitch seeming with Noel's older sister oh they have the cinematic bars this must be a flashback assuming that's Noel's mother Wow, rude. Damn, why are they bullying her? <laughs> you know, honestly, like, I thought the bullying was just straight bullshit. But then again, in Black Clover, a lot of royalty and how they act here. A lot of nobles and how they act. Straight garboder, my boy. So, you know. Yeah, Solid's a bitch, though. I hate Solid. She should have just let Solid get attacked. IMO. This is what I really, really hate. But it's a hate that is part of the series that is definitely needed. It's just how condescending people are in this world. They're so goddamn condescending. See, at least she's trying. See, at least she's trying. They're talking about it's so pathetic. She can't do this. She can't do that. But she's trying her best. You can't get mad at someone who's trying their fucking best. Solid, you should just honestly just get bodied by, by compass, bitch. And you know what? Even though Nozelle... Actually, I don't remember. So he decided for her to join the Black Bulls. So even though Nozelle isn't as condescending as the brother and sister, but he's just as much of a bitch. Even though if he's like slowly redeeming himself in this series right now, or he's like accepting Noelle, recognizing her, saying like, you know, come with us, show us the power of the Silva family. Fuck you. Fuck you. You're just as much to blame as those two over there. That's just me though. Cause I know, I know what it's like. You think someone's going to defend you? They're supposed to be the leader of the household, but instead, oh, how do I express? Sometimes not defending the person that you're supposed to defend is just as bad as dissing them. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. That's just me though. Yeah, see, even though he's just, he's saying that now come on noel just concentrate baby girl you got it no zell's low-key a boss though even though i i still don't fully like him yet okay purposely flooding the place that's smart that noel actually thought of that like this bitch still going drown she, she's using a human body even though she has elf magic oh fuck just because she looked like mother yo noel's mom though that's why I tried to keep you off the battlefield. But the way he did it was so condescendingly. I, see, like, that that's what I'm saying. Like, I understood his intentions. But at the same time, he should have defended her in a sense. She was literally getting fucking bullied. While you were just there watching because you wanted to keep her off the battlefield. That's just as bad in my opinion. But at least I'm glad that he's recognizing her strength. I do have a sense of respect for Nozal, but he's still a bitch. <laughs> kind of like Endeavor. Still a bitch, but I have a sense of respect for him. Let's just get, get the fuck out of here. At least Nozel's apologizing for the shit that he's done. At least no vital organs look like they were hit. It was just like his sides. Oh, she gonna awaken that third eye? <laughs> you can let Solid and Nebra die. I, I don't see I don't see that as an issue. <laughs> I understand they are your siblings, but they're kind of bitches. Oh, oh, oh! <laughs> Oh lord! Yo, wait, 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 wait! Whoa! I mean, I knew it was coming, but whoa! We're getting it already. The biggest factor in getting spells to manifest is natural talent, but dedicated training and unwavering effort can also pay off. In some rare cases, intense wishes and determination. Yeah, that's one thing. But I also believe that hard work beats talent every time. Powerful magic and natural resourcefulness. Yep, that's why a lot of royals and nobles are a bunch of fucking bitches. She fought for her life. See, not only did she work really fucking hard, she's in a dire situation. So it's two situations in one. She is naturally talented, but it was hard for her to unlock it. Dude, oh my god, we're getting this shit. Yes! Oh my god, this was like one of my favorite moments of this arc. She looks straight. Woo! <laughs> she looks straight like a Fire Emblem character. Let's go! Oh shit, let's go, Noel! Oh my god, they're gonna they're gonna up the ante on this animation, huh? It's Noel, of course. They have to. Ooh, Jin playing! She dodging! She skirt skirting in the air with water. 
just like her beautiful mother. She's all thinking about her mother in this life or death situation right now. And there's Nozel like, holy shit, it looks like mama. So fucking calm. Dude, who would have thought like compass magic is that powerful? <laughs> She's just compass, bitch. Nope. Nope. I like how it's just focused on her boobs for a little bit. Man, Noelle, step up, though. It's so cool to see her get this, like, this heavy moment. She's had a lot of great moments, like, when she had the sea dragon's roar and the lair. That's cool. But here, she unlocked this fucking armored stage. It's like a whole new thing. Not only does she know how to attack from far range, but close range, and she has support. She's literally, she's literally powerful as fuck. It's like, in that form, she can, she can, like, pair up with Ast if she wanted to, like, keep up with him. This bitch, this bitch using fire. Oh, <laughs> let's go! Zora. Now this is what we call Prince Zora. He's the king. Oh, it's like he's giving them a bath and he's healing them. All he do is flaunt your arrogance. Dude, yes, I love I love when he does that. He straight up fucking puts them in their place. He looked up to his mom. That's cute. His mom was waifu as fuck. Powerful as fuck. He's just running his mouth, talking to shit. In a way, he's overdoing it. <laughs> but fuck it. <laughs> It's super cool that Zora ult has really solid support magic. Hey, that's super great support. He lets them know where all of the traps are. Because before he would just, like, remember when we first met Zora, he would not tell even Asta where it is or Mimosa. They kind of had to guess and Asta would unfortunately get caught up in the in the traps. Now that he's letting them know, it's kind of like he's really trying to work with them because they know that they are the real enemy, even though he hates Royal so much. Oh, nice. Rain of silver. Or fucking raining mercury, though. Nice. It's cool that it shoots the rain back up. That's a powerful fucking team. Think about it. Noelle, Nozelle, and Zora. Fuck, that's so stupid. I really, really like Noelle's new form, too. Noelle's new form is, like, it's pretty fucking dope. Oh, man. This is actually a part of... There's, there's a few... Man, there's so many good parts. Like I said, this arc has so many good moments. This being one of them. Finally seeing Noelle's fucking upgrade. Noelle just doing more than just her in the back and just using a wand and doing, like, so not only support magic, but also, like, distance attacks. We see her go full-on combat combat mode in like close range combat which is really dope and i love how it is in parallel with her mother her mother used steel magic whereas noelle is using water magic so she's like the water form of her mother the moist form if i do say so myself now i was talking a lot already in the reaction so i don't need to go too much about it about how i feel about nozelle nozelle is cool i respect him in a way but at the same time you know like i said i i feel like he needs to do more the way he was going about protecting the sister he was protecting the sister he meant well but how we did it he went about it in the wrong way in my opinion he could have helped cultivate his uh his sister's magic could have cultivated noelle's magic into her getting stronger because i'm pretty sure the reason why, why he sent her to the black bulls is so she can find her own way of fighting if anything if he helped her out maybe she would have been stronger in a different way but it's it's a gift and a curse you know like fuck fuck zebra and solid though i don't like <laughs> but yeah this this episode was just you know trying to put into parallel the, the similarities of noelle and the mother but in a sense of just like in terms of their magic steel magic versus water magic and noelle made it her own by using water magic and she's like the dancing princess knight but compass bitch got bodied immediately i remember when i was reading this i i don't have the reaction anymore because i took it down from youtube i was screaming i was screaming really really hard because seeing noelle's new true form is so dope to see especially animated and to see what it looks like and it looks even just seeing it now in the anime putting it like side by side to noelle's mother it's so closely similar and i love it but overall I want to know what your guys' thoughts. Would you guys let... Would you guys accept Nozelle's apology? I mean, I accept it in a way. But do you guys still think he's, like, whack for not helping his sister out in a way? Not defending her against the, her other older brothers and sister? I don't know. I just feel like he could have he done more as an older brother. He meant... Like I said, he meant well. But I felt like he could have done it differently. But that's just... That's just my personal opinion, okay? My personal opinion. I want to know your, what your guys' thoughts are. Um, but anyways, guys, that is my live reaction review of Black Clover. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys go ahead and drop a like for me because that would help me a lot. Subscribe. Don't forget to click that notification bell, my boys. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.